loves to say. I don't know if you know that DSS famous line of coaching. Play smart. Yeah. Let's play smart. The I, I, I like his uh he told me a Javon saying Oh my god, Baron's a up smash. Okay. <laughs> that's that's a thing. Uh is if you're not thinking, you're not playing Smash, is something that Trevante has said. And it's really fitting. Oh, wow. Just on top of Diaz's rolls right now. And right now, oh, oh okay. doesn't get the sweet spot, but still sitting on the screen. So much damage being put on right now. And Virus just waiting out the neutral beef from DSS and just knew it was coming. Yeah, it, such great awareness. That's a, that's a favorite setup of Ido when he was here over the summer. Uh, but legit having none of it, not legit, Virus having none of it. No, but right away, I love the aggressiveness that Virus is showing right now. Yeah. Especially just right out the gate. But, ooh. All right, that was a really solid DI, getting himself out of that situation. I feel like that might be a little bit risky, considering the amount of rage on Meta Knight and Meta Knight's very strong punish game. That could, it could end badly if he's not careful enough. Uh, but Virus is, one of his strongest qualities is his ability to seamlessly change from zoning to uh, to aggression without without a drop of a hat. Like, I've seen him frame trap people and close the gap at the same time. Yep, and right now, you, uh, like, to your point, Virus is just staying back, throwing out a lot more projectiles than he was in the beginning. Oh my god! No! Yo! DSS's ability to use Drill Rush as an edge guarding tool has always been impressive, especially these past couple months. And uh, okay, I can't stop smiling at that right now. Like yeah. that was such a smart move coming from DSS, knowing that Virus and Rob only has one way really to recover with the upbeat, yeah. and just took complete advantage of that. And the fact that you can't air dodge out of the uh, up uh, upbeat as Rob, knowing that that was going to work, and I think might, what might have even been a factor is because uh, the drill rush drags the opponent. It might have even caused Ooh, an attack. But that falling back here coming from Virus, evening up the set now. Great stuff to him right there. And now, really what this is going to come down to is how Virus is playing this out with the top. But, oh my god, this ledge trap game right now. Oh man, I mean, you don't mess with the Rob on the ledge. Such a strong, not just edge guarding presence, but ledge guarding presence too. Oh my gosh, and again, finding these back airs very cleanly. Uh, right away, <laughs> Virus is evening up this I, set. I do like DSS's use of the uh, multiple jumps there uh, to avoid the that whole situation. You have so many extra jumps as uh, Meta Knight gives you a lot more resources than other characters. The other characters, if they double jump there, now you have a really bad landing. But Meta Knight can afford to stall a bit. But Meta Knight does land onto that up smash. I'm yeah. losing that stock very early. I, I mean, to be fair, I thought he was out of range too. Like. Rob's I, I, kn I knew that he. I, I like saw that he was gonna get the up smash, and I thought he was gonna live. But I don't know. I just, it's, it's just that strong. It's it's really you strong. Accept, you gotta accept it sometimes. But no, great stuff too. <laughs> Immediately, cloud. Uh, he got the po and right away, DSS just smiley put up the thumb like, yeah, I know. The, you I know, got the pocket. The, the great thing is, I wish he wasn't wearing his sweater because yet his shirt right now is cancer busters. I feel like that's really fitting when you're playing as Cloud, but... I'm so upset. And speaking <laughs> of cancer, um, DSS opting to go the way of the true Cloud mains. Uh, charge up that limit real quick. Yeah, I, I But he's taking so much for doing so. so. He, here's the thing. This is a matchup that when Stark runs into Virus, he tends to actually go Ike over, over Cloud, okay. which, which says to me that Virus has a certain amount of competency in this matchup. It might not go as well as DSS is hoping, but right now, he's got a great juggling situation doing all of these reps right now. We got like 10 reps right there. That's such a sad robot. <laughs> he, he's probably stuck on Windows 8 right now. He's getting hit by all these up airs. All right, well, oh. that was a really, actually a really nice conversion. Yeah. <laughs> throw, throw the top and get a nice dash attack in. Oh, goes for that hard uh, F smash read. I think he was expecting a spot dodge right there. Gets caught by uh, Virus' own F smash. No, and Virus is really setting himself into the lead right now in this set and now it's put pressure is on DSS to go ahead try to take this stock and get something going yeah uh, also good call out by virus to forward roll at that moment that is one of those mix-ups with clouds cross slash that timing variance you can do oh just goes right forward and gets it okay oh, you have to and I and right there I think it just canceled out the gyro if I'm not mistaken but DSS just again trying to charge up this limit, standing there menacingly. I'm surprised he's gonna going for it again because the first in the first stop when he was charging up that limit, Virus just got a barrage of so many projectiles into all those conversions. Speaking of conversions, the easiest one to get cross slash. You know, hit that hit that side B a couple of times. 
Man, yeah, it's such a scary situation being on that ledge. Okay, Virus finally finding his way. Now back again on the ledge against a Limit Cloud. He's so close. Okay, this is... Okay, he's at death percent to cross slash. Absolutely is. DSS knows it, lands with it, and frame traps with the Nair to get down safely. Man, I don't... I wonder... Yeah, I, I agree with Virus immediately going to the Smashville platform, recognizing that none of his aerials are beating that cloud up air right now. Oh, of course not. And actually, is Nair even disjointed? Uh, Rob there, I believe slightly, but mm, not as okay. much as, uh, up air apparently. Wow! Jab, jab, All right, DSS. Up DSS smash. immediately knew that that up smash was gonna hit and just hit, quickly hit that top. Yeah. All right, but you know, sometimes your pocket clouds pay off. I know, it totally does. It's, it is a fantastic character to have as a pocket. It's oh, of course. I mean, Cloud is just one of those characters that it's either going to go really well for you or really bad for you. <laughs> and DSS, in that first talk, it was going terribly. Yeah. Then afterwards, you know, he read his tag, he thought about it, and <laughs> he, he learned that up air is a phenomenal move yeah. and continued to use it. Yeah, it covered Virus's landings for the vast majority of that game. Oh, of it course. took Virus near the very end to finally get around it, but coming in through with that uh, clutch up smash read, uh, and I know this is this is one of the trickiest things is figuring out what stage to take DSS because this man has so many characters and so many of them can do such gross things on a different spread of stage. Like if you take him to Town and City, he's like, okay, well I'll go Meta Knight. If you take him to Battlefield, he has a Ness. You yep. know, take him to all these places, and he's got scary characters for all of them. Yep, and FD, he, he can still just bust out the Diddy Kong if he wants to. Oh, yeah, yeah. But the only the, my only thing with DSS busting out the Diddy Kong is the fact that Virus has so much experience with none other than legit. It's I mean, he does have tons of experience. Still a really bad matchup for Rob, true, true. despite that. Uh, yeah, that would actually... No, actually, no, that would be that would be terrifying. Because if, if that happened, he if, if Virus took him to FD... DSS could say, okay, I'll go Diddy, and then Virus could say, okay, I'll go Luigi. Wait, wait, wait. Virus has a, a Luigi? He has a Luigi. Okay. Yeah, so... If Yo, can that just happen? I, I just love to I see would, the character I would switches. adore to see that. Just because I've never seen Virus's Diddy Kong, and that would actually be pretty hype. Yeah, I mean, it's, I meant, I meant Luigi. Luigi. He, uh, he's gone it. Uh, he goes. It, that's his character of choice against uh, Legit, and sometimes he wins that, sometimes he doesn't. Okay. Uh, but and then again, he hasn't... He hasn't been as active these days, so I don't know if his Luigi is up to snuff compared to everything else. Uh, they're not going to Delfino. They're not doing Omega Battlefield. Oh, they're doing Omega. Okay, okay. they are going so to Omega FD. Omega Palutena. So it looks like he, they were going to FD, but okay. they didn't want the Flash. So, yeah, so uh, it ends up being... Oh, yeah, no no Flash. And also, DSS staying clock. Oh, no. No, it looks like he's, he's going to switch. Is he going to go to Diddy? If he goes to Diddy, we might see it. We might see it. I know. This This is just showing. He's, virus is laughing, so maybe it's happening. He's like, come on, just do it. Just let, let me just dig into my pockets right now and take it out. Oh, Madomo, I see you in there. I know you're terrified of that Luigi. Oh, man, that, that Cyclone off stage, scary, scary oh, stuff. So we're not getting a switch. Oh. We're just going to go to FD. What was the point of going to Omega? I don't know. Maybe they just remembered that they can't or something. I don't know. All these players, I mean, they, they, they just can, but these players, man. All right, but going into game three right now, this will decide the set. And Virus opting to just go for a lot. Oh, nice team job coming from DSS, though. Yeah, and right there we saw Virus slide into a little bit of a down tilt pressure, then immediately back off and go right back to zoning again. And I, so far, uh, Virus has been playing a lot more passive this game, right? He gets his hits in, but then he immediately backs off. Like right there, backs off and tries to get that tilt. Oh! He reflected it with a uh, with side the side beat. That was a phenomenal call out. Wow! From Virus right there. Oh, now getting the up smash and only taking 37% on this first stock. Wow! What a great punish for the air dodge right there. Okay, but can we just go back to that call out? This yeah. man, Virus, knew that DSS was gonna opt for the neutral beat. I mean, because if, if DSS went with anything else, a nair, an up air, literally a limit cross a slash button, instead. Yeah, any other button, but. Neutral beam definitely was going to have something happen. And right now, Virus still making those call outs, still calling out that air dodge, getting it down air. Again, not finding the sweet spot that he's looking for. But this is such a dominant position right now. It's a reminder for why Stark does not usually opt for this matchup. Oh, oh man. Okay. DSS still finds the regrab, though. Tries to get his little limit in. Okay. Ooh, getting hit by the top. Yeah. And now the laser. Do you still have a jump? No, he ends up using it right there. And Virus just walling him out right now. Getting caught by that down smash. The DI keeping him in this. Oh my gosh. 
right there. Not quite going to kill. Full rage on DSS now. Wow, that shield. I like that setup too. It this covers is actually going to be it. Yep. Yeah, that is. The up throw is going to wrap that up. Great stuff to Virus finishing up this set with a two stock. Wow. What what an adaptation, considering that how the first game went and then immediately cleaning that up and saying, oh, no.